At least 20 people have been killed and dozens were injured after a missile attack in the city centre of separatists held Donetsk. Now, according to rebels, the Tokka missile was shot down by their fighters, but a cluster charge exploded in the centre of the city. Предварительно 20 мирных жителей погибло, 13 ранено, но разведка продолжается. Повреждения огромные, центр города, самый центр, густонаселенный район. Pro-Russian separatists control part of Ukraine's Donetsk region. They accuse Kiev of committing war crimes because a child was also among those hit in the alleged strike. Moscow was quick to slam Kiev for the attack. The Kremlin said three things that the attack was unprovoked, that no armed forces were at the position, and civilians were deliberately targeted. I would like to draw your attention to the fact that the decision to use this type of missile weapons is made at least by the commanders of the Ukrainian grouping of troops, after approval by the leadership of the armed forces of Ukraine in Kiev. All this once again confirms the Nazi and anti-human nature of the ruling regime in Ukraine today. Now, Ukraine is narrating a different story. The ministry has denied the attack and hence provided no evidence for the same. Ukrainian military spokesman said in a televised briefing, and I quote, it is unmistakably a Russian rocket or another munition. There is not even any point talking about it, unquote. Ukraine has time and again accused Russia of planning false flag operations, this to create pretexts for further offensives. At this point, we cannot confirm if the alleged attack in Donetsk is of that nature. Now, Donetsk is part of the Donbass region, which is where the war started. Donetsk and Luhansk are controlled by separatist leaders over the past few years. Now, they declared independence from Ukraine in 2014. No country had recognized the Republic as sovereign state until now. While Russia does not claim it openly, but Ukraine believes that the Kremlin funds the rebel groups. Amid the devastating war, Ukraine has denied that it will try to recapture the eastern cities of Donetsk and Luhansk. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.